What's going on guys, the Ross XB here with another Minecraft video. Today I'm gonna to be showing you how to build a fence that is retractable. Or I don't know, it goes up and down. That's kinda of what I mean. Watch and observe. Very simple, fence just goes up and down with the uh, switch. You could probably wire this up to a uh, pressure plate if you wish, or a button. It's nothing difficult. Uh, let's take a look at the wiring, and uh, after the wiring I'll get to uh, showing you how to build a very long fence using the same method. So we go under here, under the hood, and we have redstone. This isn't necessary. So uh, the essential thing that is the theme, I should say, is going on here is that the redstone just goes around and goes straight to the pistons. Now the pistons need to have wires going straight to them. They cannot be connected or they won't work. Let me show you that. I don't know why. I, I don't know if this is a bug. I don't think it is. I think this is... I can't get in there. I think it's supposed to be like this, but I could be wrong. See, watch. I put that and they go down. The redstone... Red, uh, excuse me. <laughs> the redstone has to be going straight to them. That's why I used a uh, block over here to uh, conduct the redstone. Put it in the piston very easy it's uh... it's I, I think it's cool i like it um... pistons are probably one of the coolest things that minecraft has to offer now I've, personally because i mean there's just so many things you could do there's endless possibilities with pistons so uh... i love it so over here the big one say one day you want to have a fence but then the next day you don't want to have a fence i got you covered it's uh, the same method over here. You just use redstone repeaters, like so, so that you get one straight current. Go oh, I destroyed that one. So you get one straight current going into the fence, into the piston holding the fence. One straight current. You just need one line going straight to them. That's why you need to use the repeaters, because if they're all connected, it's not going to work. But once again, I don't know why that is. But, uh, yeah, you can use this in a few ways. You could use it to, I don't know, fend off attackers, fend off creepers. It's a good way. If you, uh, want to have a, uh, drawbridge, some, uh, something similar to a drawbridge, like I showed you in my last video, how to make a retractable bridge. But, uh, say you want a fortress around your house, you keep it up, but you want to leave, you want to go out, and you do that, and you're out. Now, uh, the timing's a little off, because I had to use a, a repeater down here to keep the current going, and, uh, redstone is flowing to this piston right here, which is why it goes first. It's a little eager. Thanks for watching, guys. If you liked this video, make sure to go down below and like it. If it was one of your favorites, go ahead and save it to your favorites, and don't forget to subscribe. You can follow me on Twitter, twitter.com slash therossxp. I have Google+, Plus. I'll link that in the description. Uh, I also started a second channel. I know, I have, like, 40 some subscribers I don't really need a second channel but I started it to put uh, random stuff like my new intro which you saw at the beginning of this video I put that on there as a uh, sample and maybe I'll put a vlog or something I don't know when I'm bored my last video the uh, piston bridge has over 1300 views now and to me that's pretty crazy because I didn't post that that long ago it was only like a month or so and I think it was in July personally I think that's awesome Thank you guys so much for helping me out with this, and uh, hopefully I can continue to inform and entertain you. Uh, don't forget to check out my last video once again. I, I already said that. I'm going to go now.